Ladies and gentlemen, please have a seat. Uh, Lewis, uh, tonight, uh, in just a little while here, uh, we got from uh, So Help Me Todd, yeah. new show on CBS. Uh, Skylar Aston will be here. Woo. And <laughs> Todd himself. Todd in the flesh. Todd. And in just a few minutes, right over there, Reggae Jean Page mm. from the Dungeons and Dragons movies. We know him uh, from, uh, what's it called, that one? The Brookington, what was that thing called? The Bridgerton. Wither Witherton? <laughs> Bridgerton, right. That one. Bridgerton. That one. I used to come into the room and watch Evie watching it. But um, uh, he's, he's going to be on here. And, you know, scientists said uh, recently that uh, science says, due to the, uh, the golden ratio, he is the most handsome man in the world. Really? That's what that's, that's yeah, science. That's science. Can't argue. With that's that. just, that's yeah. not me. That's yeah. just science. Yeah. You know, he he he'd make a very sexy priest. I, I bet. <laughs> Folks, uh, this Friday is St. Patrick's Day, and I am I am so proud of my Irish heritage. I I wear it on my sleeve, which is almost as pale as my thin, translucent skin. <laughs> we don't produce collagen, sadly. For some reason, a holiday that ends with scraping green vomit and teeth off your shoes can sometimes contribute to harmful stereotypes. But there is a constant threat to the dignity of Irish people, and more importantly, to the dignity of Irish celebrities. Thankfully, one of those celebrities just recorded a public service announcement to address it once and for all. Seamus? Hi there. I'm dramatic Irishman Liam Neeson, and I'm here to address a very serious issue affecting my countrymen. I'm talking, of course, about Irish name awareness. For centuries, my people have been having their names slaughtered by Americans who don't know how to pronounce them properly. So please, remember, it's Saoirse Ronan, not She Sells Seashells Ronan. <laughs> Donal Gleeson, not Dorniel Gleeson. Sinead O'Connor, not Synod McDonald's. <laughs> Katrina Balfe, not Cat Rhino Barf. Killian Murphy, not silly man Christopher Nolan guy, and Kenneth Branagh, not, as I've heard many of you pronounce it, Kenneth Branagh, man. So before you speak an Irish name, think of the suffering you may cause my people. People you may know as Coney O'Bingbang, Bonobus, Colin Fecal, Pete Brastrap, and even myself, Lyle Nelson, a.k.a. Leslie Nielsen, a.k.a. Rafe Fines. So this St. Patrick's Day, I'm begging you, please, say our names correctly and don't fall prey to lazy Irish stereotypes. Now, if you'll excuse me, it's time for me lucky charms with my spoon made out of, uh, you've guessed it, potato. Thank you, Liam Neeson. You can see Liam and Marlowe in theaters now. We'll be right back with Reggae Champagne.